In this tutorial, we're going to cover how to process a voice authorization. It is important that you've already reviewed the manual transaction for the online terminal video before proceeding with this one. So I uh, we went ahead and preset our information for customer data. We're going to go ahead and scroll down into payment information. Here we'll put in the amount that we called in for our authorization. So basically this is saying that you have called into your merchant service provider and they have issued you an authorization already. So here we're going to put in our amount plus two dollars in tax which is our total is twenty two dollars. So I have already called in got an authorization code to process this transaction later. For whatever reason you may not be near the online terminal or your computer but your merchant service provider will have an 800 number for you to obtain an authorization code. That authorization code is then put in the voice auth code box. Then you put in their credit card number. Expiration date. And of course the three digit code that you got from the back of the credit card. Then we'll put in our order description such as lawn care and then submit the transaction. Then you will see that it tells you that your voice authorization is successful. You're not going to get an AVS or CV read 2 response because of the fact that you've already called in for that information. So it's not rerunning the transaction, it's only submitting the transaction into your current batch in order to be closed out. You can of course print a receipt or go ahead and process another transaction. And that concludes this tutorial.